Hey guys, welcome back to Click Academics. In today's video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to solve this exponential equation. So we have 3x to the power of 3 over 9 to the power of x is equal to 81. So, for our solution, so we start with 3x to the power of 3 over 9 to the power of x is equal to 81. Now, 9 here, this is the same thing as 3 to the power of 2. So, if I substitute in 3 to the power of 2 for 9, I get 3x to the power of 3 over 3 to the power of 2 to the power of x is equal to 81. This is equal to 3 to the power of 4. So 3 to the power of 4. Now, if I have something in the form a to the power of m to the power of n, this is equal to a to the power of m times n. So 3 to the power of 2 to the power of x, that is going to equal 3 to the power of 2x. Now, if I have something in the form a to the power of m over a to the power of n, this is equal to a to the power of m minus n. So in this case, I have 3 to the power of x to the power of 3 over 3 to the power of 2x is equal to 3 to the power of 4. And now this is going to equal 3 to the power of x to the power of 3 minus 2x is equal to 3 to the power of 4. So now, because these two bases are the same, if I have something in the form a to the power of m is equal to a to the power of n, then this means that m is equal to n. So in this case, x to the power of 3 minus 2x would equal 4. So if x to the power of 3 minus 2x is equal to 4. So now if I subtract 4 on both sides, I have x to the power of 3 minus 2x minus 4 is equal to 0. Now we have to test out possible solutions. So all we need to do is find one solution and then we can find the rest. So let's first try x is equal to 1. So if x equals 1, then we have 1 to the power of 3 minus 2 times 1 minus 4 is equal to 0. 1 to the power of 3 is 1, so I have 1 minus 2 times 1 is 2, minus 4 equals 0. 1 minus 2 is negative 1, negative 1 minus 4 is negative 5. So negative 5 minus 0, this is wrong, so x does not equal 1. Now I'm going to try 2. So I have 2 to the power of 3 minus 2 times 2 minus 4 is equal to 0. 2 to the power of 3 is 8, minus 2 times 2 is 4, so I have 8 minus 4 minus 4 is equal to 0, 8 minus 4 is 4, so I have 4 minus 4 is equal to 0, and 4 minus 4 is 0, so I have 0 equals 0, because this is right, x minus 2 is a solution. So now, I have, because x, x equals 2 is a solution, x minus 2 times something is equal to zero. So we want to find the something. However, we already have one solution, which is x equals two. Now to find this, what we're going to have to do is from our original equation, x to the power of three minus two x minus four is equal to zero, we are going to have to divide x minus two. And this way we can find our other solution. So now I have x to the power of 3 minus 2x minus 4 divided by 
x minus 2. And I'm going to be using synthetic division. So first off, because this is x minus 2, we have 2 over here. And then we use our coefficients. So we have 1, negative 2, and negative 4. Sorry, this is actually going to be, because we're missing the x squared, it's going to be 1, 0, then negative 2, then negative 4. So we first start by bringing the denominator 1, 2 times 1 is 2, then 0 plus 2 is 2, 2 times 2 is 4, and then negative 2 plus 4 is 2, finally 2 times 2 is 4, and negative 4 plus 4 is 0. So now, the first coefficient is going to be 1, so I have x squared plus 2x plus 2. And this is equal to 0. So now, my two equations are x minus 2 times x squared plus 2x plus 2 is equal to 0. Now this gives me two equations. I have x minus 2 is, is equal to 0. Now so I have x squared plus 2x plus 2 is equal to 0. So for x minus 2 equals 0, we already know that if we add 2 on both sides, we get x equals 2. But we already had that solution before. Now for x squared plus 2x plus 2 equals 0, I'm going to be using the quadratic formula negative b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac over 2a. Now in this case, a is 1, b is 2, and c is 2. So I have negative 2 plus or minus the square root of b squared, so 2 squared minus 4 times 1 times 2, all over 2 times a, which is 1. Now this is equal to negative 2 plus or minus the square root of 2 squared is 4, so 4 minus 4 times 1 is 4, 4 times 2 is 8, over 2 times 1 is 2. Now this is equal to negative 2 plus or minus the square root of 4 minus 8 is negative 4 over 2. Now, the square root of negative 4, we could write as the square root of 4 times the square root of negative 1 or 2. And if you guys didn't know the square root of negative 1, that's equal to i. So now I have negative 2 plus or minus the square root of 4 i over 2. And the square root of 4, that's equal to 2. So I have negative 2 plus or minus 2i over 2. Now if I divide 2, I get negative 2 divided by 2 is negative 1. So I have negative 1 plus or minus 2 divided by 2. These two cancel out, so i. So my three solutions are negative 1 plus or minus i, 2, sorry, negative 1 plus i, negative 1 minus i, and 2. So these are my three solutions.